I think I should just show it to you. It's not often that I find a game that I basically decide, yeah, I should play that the second I see it, but that's what this happens for. So I already have quite a few stuff, but I haven't actually completed the game yet. Oh wait, there's something up. Uh, I didn't see that one. Okay, uh, let's get up here. I'm an idiot, but I have... I have a high jump, why do so why not try to do that? There we go. Is there something up there? Probably. I should go there. Uh, this it has a bit of like um, exploration style gameplay. Five out of eight. And that's one of the cool things. Um, there's some exploration to it. First, let's see what we're gonna do. Uh, something else. Movement speed and reload speed sounds good. Now, what weapons do we have here? Um, a sniper, it's like a grenade you can throw, submachine guns. I don't like these, but they will have to do for what the gameplay is worth there. Um, one of the big changes compared to what I usually play. Uh, AKA Gunfire Reborn, because that's my highest uh, gun based thing. Is where actually does this work? Looks okay, 30% CPU. It's not that much. To be fair, I have a pretty big CPU. The only thing that's potentially problematic would be the GPU in this scenario, I think. The game does overheat my computer quite a bit, so this is like minimal graphics settings. Um, but what I want actually want to talk about is basically that um, it's faster and it's a lot more focused on the actual guns compared to Gunfire Reborn. In Gunfire you have a lot of the uh, mobile upgrades and a lot of the scrolls that do a lot of the damage. Um, this game it's seemingly very much more focused on the actual guns. Nice and upgrade um, what I gonna run. It's really good, I like it. Could be good for runs. So that's you sort of. Oh, these are nice. I already have like uh, weapon upgrades that I basically get. Uh, they can propel me in the air, as you can see on the right side there. Uh, the character that I'm currently playing is one that I personally uh, enjoy the most. It's a uh, mixed build you can go with him. He has lots of values and stuff. But yeah, I just enjoy it a lot. You have a shotgun as a temporary weapon and a rocket. Being a really nice combination. Especially because. Oh fuck. Because I'm already running a shotgun, so it's double efficient. Right, you can have two weapons if you want to. Um, I hope everything's fine. Be a pain. Pulsar rifle. That's a normal rifle. That's a sniper. I don't like these. I there's like a revolver I enjoy and most of the shotguns are nice. This is pretty good since I do explosive damage due to my uh one weapon. Oh. Can open a burn damage and damage on the first shot. Pocket reload speed and burning enemies. I'm gonna run that one, I think. Uh, the mini attack is not worth much. Let's go through here. But I just think the general idea of one this deals fire, which is really, really nice. Uh, what? Yeah, I have to do that. Uh, these things on the rails up there are uh, experience bots, basically. If you uh, kill them before they go from one side to the other you get uh, some bonus XP so it's always worthwhile keeping them and trying to kill them in time. Yep. These are uh, like item vaults that you have to do and they give you stuff to complete them. Wow that's easy. Um, that's a bow. I could play that. They're not particularly good, sadly. Ouch. Uh, 
there's a carbine in the game that I really enjoy playing because it's also better than the bow. It's generally my type of weapon, just weapons that have uh, a very accurate long-ish range. Uh, flying enemies, head bonk. Oh, I gotta run that one. I'm also shit at dodging. As well as the fact that's here. Go off, die, okay. Uh, probably wanna still use the new sword offs here. Because I need a lot of damage and that probably just does more. Fire is pretty useful, all in all. Uh, there's like several effects, uh, effect types. Fire is the damage one. Oh, nice. Um, I have the mini roll. That's pretty nice. Marking enemies. First damage. It's specifically nice against big ones, but. Hitting everybody. Uh, ice is a defensive element, basically. What do you have here? Nope, not worth it. Not do that. I shouldn't have done that. It's not worth it. One big thing bosses are really nice. They're fairly easy, though that's kind of to be expected from a boss of the first area, right? I still get it, but like, it's not. You're not gonna kill me. I can't really show it off, right? But they have lots of different attack patterns. It works well with the movement. Wow, I did not get a lot of XP that round. Now we are basically the second stage, which are the fields. Uh, yeah. I do gotta have to be able to concentrate a bit more in this area. Jet roller. New thing. Fire red is pretty good, elemental damage. I can run that definitely. And you already saw I take a lot more damage. Uh, let's at these levels. Charge speed, not worth it, not worth it. Ah. Wow, okay, that was pretty bad. Uh, I didn't get the um, random guy in the background there. Air for hook, and that's kind of annoying. Nothing to upgrade, I do already have most of that done in fairly short time, right? 